Thousands of families lost everything in eastern Kentucky when the creeks rose in the dark of night. And even as they searched for their next meal, WDRB's Conroy Dilution Zach Crabtree witnessed that they're all working to help each other. Homes, schools, buildings that date back to the coal boom in the early 1900s. They all survived historic floods before, but last Thursday brought more water than they ever imagined. The destruction stretches for miles. You're looking right now at the city of Fleming Neon in Letcher County. This is Main Street. Every building had water almost up to the ceiling, including City Hall, which has been moved to higher ground. On our way to this city, we drove through communities along Highway 343, including Mac Roberts. That's where we met Don Young, who can't swim, but found the strength to survive the rising water. Even though he and his wife will have to rebuild their lives, He's thinking about others who are suffering. I just hate it for the ones that's lost family, friends. You can't replace that. All of this, all of this can be replaced tomorrow. A life can't. There are still some people missing, but so far 37 people are confirmed dead from the floods. As you'll see tonight, that's what people who have lost all possessions are most focused on. Those who did not survive the night. Conroy Delouche, WDRB News.